Hey guys, gals, Magical Aaron again. So, um, the name of this trick is called, uh, I guess, Visual Matrix. Uh, no, not the movie Matrix, just uh, Matrix. And it goes like this. You show, uh, and by the way, just so you know, I did have a trick earlier like this, and the cards and coins are magnetic. I just want to show you these are non-magnetic cards. They don't stick to anything. Coins are not magnetic either. Okay, they don't stick. No magnets, okay? So, um, the idea is to put a one here, one here, one here, and one there, okay? One, two, three, and four. Okay, let's do that again. Here we go. So, one, two, three, four, okay? So there's one there, one there, one there, and one there, okay? What we're gonna do is go just like that. Okay, now I'm going to quote unquote show you how this is done. And it goes like this. One there. I'm going to do this actually in slow motion so you can see what's going on. Slow motion. One goes there. One goes there. And the last one goes uh, there. But in order to do that, we got to start over from the very beginning. Okay. So I'm going to do that one, a different version of that one, the one that I came up with. And this is probably what I'm going to teach you. So I'm going to do the others after this, and I'll teach you this one. Okay. And it goes like this. One there. One there. And one there. One goes there. We take the coin from under here, and I shall place it right there. And the last one goes into the hand and goes right there, okay? But again, let's start over from the very beginning. Okay? That's what I'm going to teach you how to do, okay? Uh, we'll get back to that one in a second, though. We're going to try uh, two cards, one hand, okay? And it goes like this. One there, and one there. The one from here now joins the one over there. And next we're gonna do that one at the bottom there. Just like this. This is a little bit unusual you have to follow me here. One, two, three. Actually went over there, and all I gotta do is go one, two, three, and four. One handed. And I'm going to do this with now one card, two hands, okay? And it goes something like this. One goes there. Two goes there. And the last one goes just like that, okay? So hopefully the all four should be there, but you just got one, two, three, and four. Okay, so... What I'm going to do is I'm actually going to uh, show you how to do the one with three cards. And as I said before, these cards and coins are non-magnetic to each other. And what's going to happen is you're going to use your fingers to uh, pick up the coins. And it goes like this. One, two, three. What I've done now is I've actually used my fingers to pick up a coin here and move it to there. So now here's what you have. Okay. Take the coin, do what's called a classic palm. I think I taught you classic palm. Hopefully you've been practicing. If not, I'm sorry. Probably won't be able to do this trick. <laughs> um, and I'm sorry. But here. Do that. Pick up the card. 
pick up, pretend to pick up uh, a coin, but you actually pick up nothing. Show the card and let the coin fall and place it underneath the card as you place the card back down. So now the coin's there. Take the coin, the supposed coin, and just do this underneath the card. So it sounds like there's a third coin under there. And the last one, what you're going to do is you're going to let the coin fall like this, but you're going to pull it back as you turn the card face down. So now they think there's a coin in your hand. So now this is what you have there. And do another one of these underneath the card. So now this is your situation here. Okay. So you just pick up one coin like this, go over, drop it, turn over the other two cards. And that's how you do that. Pretty cool, huh? All right, guys. I don't have anything to leave you with to, uh, to show you, but I will have something for you next time. I hope you all enjoyed that, and I hope you all enjoyed this uh, cool little thing that I have here to show you this awesome trick. And I will see you next time. Bye.